you are not old. No. Wonderful. <laughs> Let's dive into this topic. Hello there and welcome all my VIP subscribers. So nice to meet you in this video. Today I got an answer from a person. I'm an old person. And this had the vibration of sadness and even weakness a little. And I gave some answers back. But I said, this is a good topic to make a video on. When we are counting only the numbers, this is not how we estimate a human being or ourselves. So what does this mean? When we say, I'm old, then we start to compare. But to compare with what? And we should get a much broader picture. When a person says, I'm poor, I'm old, I'm not that clever, I'm not intelligent. This is all just a statement. And why? Whom are we comparing? Everything is out there. Everything is out there. The level goes from zero to never ending. So first, we shouldn't compare ourselves because we are a unique person. There's nobody that we should compare to because you are unique. You are unique. There's no comparison, not one other person. And sometimes we have our idols and we compare, but we shouldn't do this. And in the case of age, we shouldn't focus on the numbers because the longer we live here on planet Earth, what happens? Okay, our body changes, the skin changes, but we get more and more knowledge. We gather more and more information. We gather more and more feelings. A person that has a higher age has so more feelings already inside than a baby or a child with six years. So we are really rich in information in knowledge, in skills. We know how to do so many stuff. And we have a lot of feelings already. And our understanding is much higher because our perspective is higher. When we see all the good qualities that are getting bigger and bigger, I have more knowledge. I have more skills. I can understand people better. I have a broader perspective. I can feel this and I can also feel this. Alone the quality to feel so many different things that a child cannot feel. This is wonderful. We have so many interests and they will always change. So I think instead of comparing my current state to anyone else and say, I have not that what you have, therefore I am poor, or therefore I am old, or therefore I am not clever. This is just focusing on negative stuff. You look what is missing in comparison to another person, but there is no comparison. We are fulfilling our life. We gain more and more abundance in our life. And we should really see what do I have, what the other person doesn't have. This makes you feel rich. And as our qualities for ourselves are so normal, we can't see them anymore. But we should be really clear, what are my qualities? What are all these positive stuff that I gathered in my life? And we should celebrate them because this took a long time 
And we should really be grateful for our qualities. And there are some qualities that only you have, not anybody else. Yes. And there are people, I already heard people with 30 years old talking, I'm old to do this, or I'm old to do, what is this, 30 years? <laughs> there are people that say, with 40, I'm old. There are people that say, with 50, I'm old. Other people with 60, I'm old. And on the other hand, we know people that have 80 or 90 and they are so lucid. They are so clever. They are so interested in... No, no. There are people even with 33 years that have no interest in nothing and they are... Uh, uh. And there are other people with 80, 90 They are still interested. I want to do this. I will read this book. I will go to this concert. I will have a conversation. And when we are open-minded, we can gather so much information. And the joy should always run. As long as we are going through life and we feel joy, the age doesn't matter. Okay, the joy as a baby, is different compared to a child with 10 years, even 20 years. But the qualities are evolving. An adult person has so much more interesting stuff to realize than a child with 8 years. And we cannot compare ourselves with a child with 10 years. We should never compare ourselves with anybody. Sometimes we have our idols, but this is just an inspiration. When you like something, you can say, I want to do the same. But then focus on yourself. Make your journey. Don't say, now I have half of this person. No. You should say, now I have 50% more than before, because before I had nothing. And now I'm already so good in this and then I want to increase this and you find a new direction a way that only works for you and that should bring you joy as long as you feel joy it doesn't matter and as our soul our guidance system has no age at all we make time our awareness makes time Then we say, time is so important. We even say, time is money. And we say, time is so important. And then we start counting the numbers, the years, the ages. But it's not money. It's also not the time. It's the joy. Imagine a life, 80 years only suffering. Wouldn't a life... 40 years full of joy, much better. It's not about the time. It's about the quality. As long as we feel inspired, as we feel the joy by going through life, this is an intense life, a joyful life, a life that brings happiness. And it's more the joy. And when we start to compare We diminish ourselves. We shouldn't do this. We should say, what are my qualities? I praise my qualities. My qualities are unique. I only have them and nobody can even copy them. Your uniqueness cannot even be copied. This is your treasure box. You are unique and nobody can copy you. Wonderful. We have to be clear on this. And then this lifts you up. And you don't have to say, I'm old. I'm sad. No. There are so many things I can do. And I want to do this. And I want to do this. And this is interesting. I'm alive. And I want to celebrate my health. 
And as long as I'm healthy, I feel wonderful. If I'm not healthy, I do whatever I can to come back in harmony. Yes. So I think it's worth thinking on this. What do you think? You want to bring in some thoughts? Comment below. And I wanted just to share this reminder. Don't compare yourself. But celebrate what you find in yourself. Be clear what is all accumulated in your whole being. Because this is a lot. And mostly we forget this. Because it's so normal. Oh, this is not a quality. I always made this in my life. But other people say, if I had this, I would be lucky. For you, as you have it, oh, it's normal. But it's not normal. It's the treasure of the good things in life that you already accumulated. And there will still come more. As long as we live, there comes more and comes more and comes more. Yes. Thank you very much for watching, my dear VIP subscribers. And let's meet us in the next video.